Oh, that's good. Have you, uh, you just come back from Tenerife, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> it's freezing. We've got fleeces on. It's... Kids don't even want to wear shorts anymore. <laughs> no, kids have got long trousers on. It's grey. Look at that. What is that? Awful, terrible. No. Let's go back. Yeah. So because of this terrible weather, we decided to travel to a different country today. <laughs> yeah, travelling to a different country and we're walking there. Yeah. That's strange, isn't it? That's strange. Have a little guess. Where do you think we're going? <laughs> Where could we be going? Hmm. Have a guess in the comments. <laughs> Before you keep watching. <laughs> Big queue. Yeah, sizable queue. Get the British passport out, we'll skip ahead. Good <laughs> 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 This is weird, isn't it? Yeah, you walk in across where, like, what is it called? The it's runway. The runway, yeah. yeah. So every time an airplane is taking off or London, like the whole street turns off and nobody can walk or drive through the town. Yeah, everybody has to stop and wait for the airplane to yeah. land or take off. Yeah. It's weird that, isn't it? Yeah, it is strange, but it also like gives you an idea of how, how small it is if you have to do this. <laughs> yeah, six kilometers squared, yeah. apparently, the whole of yeah. where we are. And what did I read yesterday? Six kilometers squared and 300 pubs. <laughs> 350 pubs. <laughs> it's only pubs. Go on, Britain. <laughs> pubs and apes. Yeah, yeah. That's what they got here. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. You guys pretending that you like each other? Yeah. That's nice. <laughs> Once every full moon. <laughs> <laughs> so weird seeing like British road signs and stuff, isn't it? <laughs> like, I just said like the traffic lights. You just walked past the traffic light, it was British. I don't know, you can't really explain it, but the zebra crossings are British. Just so weird, don't you think? It is weird. I just said, like, I'm curious to go into like a supermarket and see what kind of stuff you can find. Yeah, can you buy sausages? Yeah, that would be nice. And uh, cheap beans. <laughs> cheap beans, yeah. I don't think the beans in uh, the UK are cheap anymore, though. No, maybe not. Can you buy sausages? <laughs> you want to buy sausages? Yeah. Do you? <laughs> Yeah, so uh, Gibraltar. Yeah. We uh, we were in the very south part of Spain, and um, we actually just ended up driving almost past the big rock. Yeah, because we were supposed to go to Tarifa yeah. yesterday, because we heard that that was supposed to be beautiful and really nice. Came there, obviously, as always, we didn't check. Well, we checked the weather, but we didn't check the wind. No. <laughs> and it was like storm. Gale force like wind, the, yeah. The van was like shaking just when we were driving. So we said like, no way, we can stay here. It's not worth spending the day there. Uh, so we kept driving and then we were heading to one place. And like you said, we just passed the big rock and we were like, Oh yeah, that's Gibraltar. Should we just stop here maybe? <laughs> Why have we not thought about doing this? Because yeah. we talked about it with loads of people, like that we're going to pass it basically. Yeah. Never thought about stopping and doing it. No. So then uh, half way through we were like stop the car and like find found somewhere to park and then we were like yeah here we are why not <laughs> <laughs> that's the sort of beauty of this sort of lifestyle isn't it yeah exactly like even if you've got plans like they can change and they can be worse and they can be better yeah exactly so we're gonna have a nice day in uh, on british soil now <laughs> <laughs> see if we can see some apes or if we're skipping that part we're not decided yet. not sure yeah it's quite overcast isn't it yeah so i don't know if we'll go up the rock or not no we'll see Pigeons! I said, didn't I say, there'd be loads of pigeons because I think they, they must import them. <laughs> so it feels a bit more British. Loads of pigeons. So I'm hoping, I've, I've ticked off pigeons, I've ticked off red phone box, Royal Mail post box, check. What else is on the list? Fish and chips. Fish and chips, British pint in a pub, maybe buy some sausages. Bonus points if it's a Tesco. <laughs> <laughs> Busy. Very busy. Yeah. We found the uh, main street. Been walking around for like two hours. Like, <laughs> oh, yeah, it looks all right. It's no, nobody here. 
so we've been to really nice harbour and yeah. stuff though we've been seeing like the nice bits now we're just in the main street yeah, yeah. to be fair it's been, uh, gonna be, it's been really nice yeah Weird. this is going to be shopping and pubs and yeah. Like now we're out for some lunch. It looks like every it looks like every city centre in the UK. Yeah, it? it does. It looks like it could be Nottingham or Manchester yeah. or whatever. Weird. And we've got the weather as well, actually. Yeah, I was just thinking that. <laughs> got to have fish and chips, haven't you? Looks like good fish. Looks like good fish. Not mushy peas, though. Shame about the peas. Disappointed. Can't have it all, can you? No, you can't. Is yours nice, Bella? There you go. Mm. Tired, Bella. Yeah. It's gonna kill me. <laughs> All right, we're in the queue for the uh, cable cars. We're gonna go and see the monkeys. Yeah. Apparently, you have to be a bit careful with the monkeys. They're a bit aggressive. You can't have food on you or anything like that. And we have got a very fuzzy microphone. <laughs> And chocolate biscuits. And chocolate biscuits, but the very fuzzy microphone I'm going to take off, so uh, there aren't any monkeys that uh, mistake it for a monkey baby. So from here on, the audio is going to drop in quality a little bit, but I'm sure you'll be all right. Is it exciting, Charlie? Yeah. <laughs> We're going up the mountain? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> During your Top of the Rock visit, you will encounter the famous Barbary macaques. <laughs> These are wild, free-roaming, tailless monkeys. They get a and will... <laughs> First monkeys of the day. Three little monkeys. <laughs> Bit of a shame about the weather. Yeah, you would have had an amazing view. The view would have been incredible from here, wouldn't it? Yeah. But it's a bit cloudy and a bit overcast, yeah. so can't really see much. No, it's still nice though. Yes, yeah, lovely. You can see, apparently you can see Africa from here really clearly. Yeah, no, you can't see. You can't see anything, anything. really, no. So they said to keep your backpack on your front, yep. so they don't steal from your backpack. Which makes me a bit worried, because if they want to steal from my backpack, they're now going to be in my face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, and they said like no feeding the monkeys, no like plastic bags because they think that there's going to be food and they're going to grab that from you. Yeah. Be aware of hats. Oh yeah. Glasses. Yeah, don't tease the monkeys because then they bite you. Mm, I'm worried about that one. <laughs> See, we've got an air tag on her if they grab her, so. <laughs> Over there, mate. So um, we're at the top of the mountain, just about to get the cable car down. The electricity's cut out. Yeah. They've got no power up here at all. It could be gone for an hour, it could be gone for a day. <laughs> We've got the kid wagon but yeah. we have to keep it closed because of the monkeys. Yeah, and like we saw somebody earlier who didn't close their push chair yeah. and there was a monkey who tried to jump into tried it. Tried to get into it, yeah. Uh, so you don't really want to put the kids in the kid wagon no. and then it comes from monkeys yeah. jumping on them. Uh, so they're trying to call a bus but the, the phones don't work. There's no signal up here at all. Yeah, let's go up the mountain. That's <laughs> it's a good idea, wasn't it? You was a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, they're sending a bus for us at least. <laughs> well, we don't know when. <laughs> yeah, but at least we. It's always something. It's always something. Isn't it? Yeah. And we were so unsure if we were going to do this because we were like, oh, is it worth it? It's not. We're not that bothered. We'll just go up. We'll have half an hour. We'll go back down. Yeah, we're stuck here. We see monkeys. <laughs> Nothing to eat. 
like we got their last cold waters because obviously no fridges or freezers are working or anything. Yeah. Can't buy anything to eat, can't buy any coffees or anything. Yeah. We just sat here waiting for an hour for hopefully a bus to come and get us. They weren't even sure whether the bus was coming in an hour. It's like, yeah, maybe it's going to be an hour, maybe it's going to be an hour and a half. Maybe. So we'll see what happens. It's never a dull day, is it? No. Always an adventure. But I do feel like it's better to sit here and wait and yeah. hopefully get on the bus yeah. than to walk down with the thief monkeys attacking you. Because <laughs> we asked, we were like, oh, are we allowed to walk down with the kids in the kid wagon? And they were like, yes, if you could sit sit in the in the wagon and don't um, no outside and no. And I thought, oh, this is never going to happen. So maybe not. Let's just wait. <laughs> One eternity later. Back on solid ground. Yes. The <laughs> electricity came back on and we could take the cable car back. Oh. <laughs> that was uh, a joke. Man. Yeah. Crazy. It's like it was very tempting to walk. Yeah. But uh, I do feel worried because I don't feel like these two are great for our wild animals. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. But we're here now. Yeah, we got down in the end anyway. Yeah, we're, we survived. We survived. We, uh, we're going to go find some ice cream for these kids. Yes, we promised them ice cream up About in the cafe, but uh, <laughs> obviously the freezer was broken, so yeah. melted ice cream they didn't really want to serve. So. Honestly, we talked about this in the podcast. You must have done something wrong in a past life. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible karma. Yeah, Nothing's ever easy, is it? No. Nothing's ever straightforward. You say it's me. It's you. It's all about me. Yeah, it was since I met you. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing bad ever happened to me before that. All right, so the guy's dislocated his shoulders about 18 times. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. All right, it was a nice day. It was, it was, <laughs> it was... Uh... Nice that we managed to get down in the end. Yeah, <laughs> we made it be... back to Sunny. Yeah, I thought we were going to be stuck up there for a little bit. Yeah, living with the wild apes. <laughs> ah, you'd have fitted in perfectly. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it was a fun day and it was fun to be tourists for a day because most of the time we don't do the touristy stuff. No. So it was fun, it was really fun. Yeah, exactly. And uh, yeah, we've got quite a lot done as well. We've recorded episode two of the podcast. Yes. And uh, now, since then, we've started moving across uh, a little bit, like on the south coast. So, yeah. heading over towards Almeria. Now. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, uh, hopefully, we'll be there by the end of the day. That's the hope. Yep, we'll see what happens. <laughs> yeah, but I think that's about it for this time. Yes, indeed. So, uh, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you next week. See you next week. Bye. Bye.